The queen courageously goes before the king, and the king not only welcomes Esther, Aww. he accepts her invitation to a banquet she's planned for just him and one special guest, Haman. Ooh. Haman Ooh. is full of himself. <laughs> full of myself? What does that mean? Who else would I be full of? There is no room for anyone else in me but me. <laughs> Nevertheless, he's really quite happy about the invitation. That is, until he encounters Mordecai. Yeah. Oh, it's the poet. <laughs> Honor me. To be or not to be. <laughs> what thou have asked of me, you shall never see. I said, bow down. No. Yes. No. Yes. No. Give me another. Yes. Never. R e s p c t. My not what it means to me. R e s p c t. Take care, T C B. By the time Haman returns to his home, he's seething and finds an evil partner in Zeresh, his wife. I got you, baby. Oh, 
Then I was young and unafraid. There were no evil men like Haven. I believe that I dreamed our love would never die. That we would always be together. I dream my people would Persia. <laughs>